I've had several people ask if I could quickly do a video to show them how to block out time for their listings on showing time. So let's get started. Log into your matrix screen and from here you should have somewhere on your home screen a box that says eternal links. Find that box and click on the showing time setup because this is the quickest and easiest way to get you to where you want to go. You're over here on the left hand side, you're going to click on listings and your listing should pop up. So for this exercise, we're going to quickly go into this property and up here at the top, we're going to click on restrictions and exceptions and we're going to add a new showing restriction. So let's just say, for example, your clients have um, family coming over this weekend. So the reason for our rule will be a family gathering. Now, mine's already auto-populated because I've put it in before, but yours may or may not be there. It's going to be, this one is going to be an all-day rule. And we're going to pick one date. So over down here, pick the date for the rule. We're going to say on Sunday. And we're going to save this showing restriction because it's only a one-time rule for the day. We're not going to recur it. So we're going to quickly save it. Now let's just say for all intents purposes that your clients have small children and they're, they would prefer that no one show the house before 10. We're going to add another showing restriction here. And they put the kids to bed by while we're doing this. So we start at 10 and they put the kids to bed at 8. So nothing from 8 o'clock on. So we're going to add this new showing restriction. We're going to call it kids. And we're going to time the rule. So the rule is going to start at 8 o'clock in the morning. And it's going to end at 9.45 so that you can start to schedule showings at 10. This is going to be a repeating rule. So the default here is timed and one time rule. We're going to quickly put it as def repeating. We're going to start this rule on Monday because they're okay for this on the weekends. And we're going to end the rule when your listing expires. The rule is going to occur every Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday, because those are the days that they've asked you to. So from here on in, you're going to save this showing restriction. You need to add a second showing restriction for the evenings. So you're going to call it Kids Night. Again, it's a timed rule, and you're going to start it at 8 o'clock and you're going to end it at 9 o'clock so it's just that one hour. We're going to repeat the rule and again we're going to start this one on Monday. We're going to finish it at the end of our listing and it's going to go every night because the children's bedtime does not change no matter what the weekend brings. So we're going to ask this to do all the days of the week and we're going to save this showing restriction. So again, on this calendar, you can see that it is blocked out from 8 a.m. to 9.45, 8 p.m. to 9 p.m. and it's also blocked out all day. Another good thing to do is once you sell a property firm, it can take a day or two for it to get marked on your board as a firm sale. So let's say it's 11 o'clock at night and you're going to, you don't want people calling you to start booking showings because you're already going to have to cancel the ones you have scheduled for the next night if there wasn't a specific day for processing the sale. So here you're going to do a showing restriction and as we did in the first one, you're going to block out the whole day and I would say do it for like three days running and the reason for that is you're going to mark it as sold. That way for the next couple of days no one's going to bother you to make it and the office will have it processed. Down here at the bottom under your calendar, if you scroll down now, you're going to see all of your restrictions and your restrictions are 
because it's so old, there's a family gathering, kids in the daytime, kids at the nighttime. I hope this helps. If you need anything else, just don't feel free. I mean, sorry. If you need anything else, feel free to reach out and give me a call. Thanks.